Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, I'm Bill. Uh, this will be a new video series. We're going to go over how to be a game master for all sorts of games. And we're going to focus in on D&D and Pathfinder first for some of the information, and then we'll use other information from other games, and we'll try to craft how to plan adventures, make dungeons, and everything else, like the most effective stuff we could take from all sorts of games. If you all have any suggestions of games we should use material from, put them in the comments below. Uh, so the first thing, the basics of being a game master is you gather your friends around table, you help them create characters, so you need to understand how to create the characters for the system you're running. <laughs> you need to understand how magic works. You don't have to know the, all the spells, you just have to know the basics of the rules about how to cast spells and stuff like that if your game uses magic. You need to know how the technology works if you're playing in a sci-fi futuristic game or even a modern day game. You'll need to know the combat rules on how everything goes with combat. And then you'll also either have to have a pre-made adventure that, you're, you've familiarized, that you've familiarized yourself with, or you'll need to craft an adventure for them to run through the first time. So, a lot of my friends, uh, we would get together the same day we create characters, we also start the adventure. A lot of 5th edition uh, players will spend their first game session just creating characters. So, everybody has their own feel on how they'd like to do that. Uh, other times, I'll have them create their characters before we even get together on the first game session. So that way, they have them ready and I just have to approve them look them over, make sure they don't have anything crazy on their character sheets. And that'd be it. Uh, an average game session, depending upon your players and your availability, is usually, for my group, between three and five hours. We average about three. Very rarely do we play longer than that unless we get together earlier in a day. And then we try to game once a week, but you would have to set up with your players how often you all want a game. And that's the basics of being a game master. So we're going to go into to the next video on planning an encounter. And then the video after that will be how challenge ratings and um, e equivalent character levels and stuff like that works. And how to use that to create an encounter for Pathfinder, D&D, &D, Starfinder, and all those. Well, until we all game again, guys.